Did you know that Active Inspire now allows you to embed HTML code right into a flip chart page? Well, you might be thinking, uh oh, I don't even know what HTML code is. Well, that's okay. Let's explore some basic information together. So, HTML is short for Hypertext Markup Language. So, next time you're at a cocktail party, impress, impress your friends and let them know what HTML stands for. But it's kind of the behind the scenes code for what you find on a web page or part of the content that you see on the internet. This is different from a link. You know, www.google.com would be a link. HTML code is kind of the background working information on a web page. Now, if you copy this code and embed it into your flip chart page, you can see that content in your flip chart without actually having to open up a web browser. And that's amazing. Now, much of this content will be live, which means that you'll have to be connected to the internet to see it within your flip chart but it will not allow you to access content that is blocked on your school's network. Now, many teachers have asked for this capability as it prevents them from having to deal with copyright issues in some cases or opening up multiple programs. If you have the correct version of Active Inspire, you'll now see an insert menu. A new choice in that insert menu will be a link called Embedded HTML, and you can see it right here on the page. So all you need to do is figure out where to get that code and put it in the box and hit save. Now, if any of this makes no sense to you, don't fear. We've got a lot of examples to show you. So the first one here is from TeacherTube. Now, let's say you want to embed this TeacherTube video from the, uh, from the internet into your flip chart page. But you don't want to download this whole video because it's too big of a file or you're not sure how to get it off of TeacherTube. All you have to do is go down here to where it says the embed code. So on every TeacherTube page, it has an embed code right here. Just copy and paste this and then go to a new flip chart page. We're gonna to go to insert, we're gonna to go to link, and we're gonna to go to embedded HTML. Now I've already gone to that page and copied the embedded link, and I'm gonna paste it right here into this new box. I'm gonna hit okay. I'm gonna give it a second, but now you can see I have that video embedded into my flip chart page. Brief now it's going to play this video, a Brief History of the United States of America. Now what's great is it's not actually, the video is not on my flip chart page, it's not taking up all that space, it's actually linked to the web. So again, I'm, I'm linking it, basically pulling it off of TeacherTube and playing it right here on my flip chart page, which is just fantastic. And I have all my options here. I can go full screen, I can adjust the volume, it's just fantastic. And I can actually adjust where I want to play it right here. And I can also still take pictures from it. So it allows me to use all my Active Inspire tools. Now, an example here from YouTube on any YouTube page, just click on where it says share and then click on embed. And then again, copy and paste that code. When you do that, it'll look like this on your page. A minute, 30 seconds. And we're going to fast forward with the to, the, to the fun Space part. Wednesday morning. Oh, we missed the fun miles part. Down range. There we go. Atlantis, go. The fun takeoff. Now, classtools.net also has some great tools that you can embed the codes. So if you click on the embed icon down there in the bottom right corner, again, copy and paste that embed code. And one of the things they have is a fantastic random name generator. And so again, right here, it plays right in my flip chart. And I can edit all these names. It's exciting stuff. Now, finally, we have one here from Google Maps. It's a great way to bring Google Maps into your page. So on this, on the Google Maps page, there's a little button right here that looks like a little, um, a little like a, uh, like a little eight or a little infinity sign. You click on that, and it'll give you the embed codes. And so now I have the Google map right on my page. And so I can actually zoom in to Charleston. And I can see we're on Broad Street. And where are we at? Broad Street and I think it's Meaning Street. But very, very cool because now I have Google Earth right here in my flip chart page. I don't have to open up Google Earth or Google Maps. A huge thanks to Catherine Vaughn the Promethean Teaching and Learning Consultant from South Carolina 
for creating this flip chart and letting it share and letting us share it with you for this active tip. Well, sure, we'll be going to be creating many more active tips on how to use this new feature in Active Inspire, as it's very, very cool. So stay tuned and enjoy. <laughs>